Hi, let's talk about AWS private link connections available in Grafana Cloud Logs, Metrics and Traces starting on September 29th. I'm Pablo Angulo and I'm a senior software engineer working on the platform team at Grafana Labs. What problem does private link connections solve? First, when you send metrics, logs or traces to Grafana Cloud, the data moves over the public internet. Even though TLS encryption and firewall rules prevent unwanted access to the data, your security team might prefer that your sensitive data doesn't transfer over the public internet at all. Second, AWS charges you for every gigabyte transferred between data centers. Depending on where your services are hosted, this cost can really add up. AWS Prime Link solves these two problems by establishing a connection over AWS private infrastructure between a consumer's VPC network and the private network of a SaaS provider like Grafana Cloud. Data is no longer transmitted across the public internet, which increases security and eliminates egress traffic fees charged by AWS. So by using private link to send us your metrics, logs, or traces, you reduce the total cost of using Grafana Cloud. So how does it work? AWS Private Link consists of two components. A VPC endpoint on the consumer side, that's your side, and a VPC endpoint service on the provider side, that's Grafana Cloud. As the service provider, we manage a load balancer in our VPC as the service frontend. This load balancer is assigned to the VPC endpoint. As a service consumer, you create an interface VPC endpoint, which establishes connections between the subnets that you select from your VPC and our provider endpoint services. The service provider and load balancer receives requests from the service consumer and routes them to the targets hosting our services. All this is always routed through internal IPs and AWS internal network, not hitting the public internet. Note that both VPCs, consumer and provider side, must be in the same AWS region. If your VPC is in a different region, you should first configure a VPC peering to another VPC in the same region as the Grafana Cloud VPC. You can find out which region your Grafana Cloud stack is deployed to on your stack details page at grafana.com. How can I configure the private link to connect to a Grafana service? Well, it's quite easy. Um, as we can see now, is you can do it in a self-serve way. Let's get hands on. I will show you how to configure it. Let's go first to our AWS console, um, VPC, and then endpoints page. Now we are going to click on create endpoint. Here we can provide a name, for example, Grafana Loki. Then we select private link ready partner services. And here we need to provide a service name. So how can you get your service name? You need to go to your Grafana Cloud instance, select your stack, and then click on the details page for the service that you want to connect. In this case, we want to connect to Loki. So we click on here on these details. Just scroll down until you see you this section, sending logs using AWS plan link. And here you have the service name value that we are looking for as well as the private DNS name that we will use later on. But by now, we copy the service in another. Paste it here, and we click on Verify Service. We get this successful message. And then we are going to select a VPC. We need to expand here these additional settings and make sure we enable DNS name. This will allow us to use the private DNS for connecting to, to the service. 
Then we select some nets, for example, these two, and a security group. Here I'm just selecting the default ones, but of course you can configure this as you need to meet your requirements. Now we are going to click on create endpoint. Now we need to wait until Amazon deploys this endpoint. It can take a minute or two. Okay, now it's ready. Perfect. So now we can use this private DNS name. You can find it here as well as in your details page to connect to Grafana Cloud and send your logs. So for example, here, this example, when you see it is the public URL, you need to replace this value by this new private DNS name. And that's all. You uh, your IBS private link connection is, is ready to be used. Um, for this example, I use the I use the AWS console, but of course you can use your favorite infrastructure as code tool to provision this VPC endpoint, as for example, Terraform. You can find an example in our documentation. So how is this price? How is the pricing for, for AWS private link? Well, here comes the good news. Grafana Cloud offer for free private link connections to all our cloud customers. You only need to pay what AWS charges you for configuring a VPC endpoint that is way lower than the egress traffic fee. You can find further documentation, um, a guide how to set up private link in our public documentation page.